Hey guys, it's Mike the Scrapper. A while back, I made a video on this, uh, this cement mixer and it had this motor attached. Do you guys remember that? All right, so cement mixer has been put on the truck. Looks like it's been out in the weather a while. <laughs> it is extremely heavy. This is the motor that was with it. You can see the wiring, see those connections there? No way am I plugging something like this in. Okay, well, this is the motor. I didn't make a video on this one yet. So now I wanna see what's in here and I know you guys are curious too. So as you can see, it's a pretty big mower, motor. It's, it's pretty heavy. And this was the cables that were attached to these look like uh, aluminum. And I was pretty scared to actually plug this in and see if it works wasn't going to bother because I'm not sure what's going to happen. It might short out or something. So um, what I decided to do was make a video on taking it apart to show you guys and for my curiosity to see what's in it. So let's get some tools here and let's... Okay, uh, big piece of, big piece of iron. Looks like there might be some copper in there but uh, you know what let's just keep going because I want the big stuff okay nothing in here just gonna cut these cords that's aluminum Get a magnet oh, this is aluminum too so, what's in here? So let's unscrew this. Okay, now for this little flywheel here. I sprayed the area with some of this stuff. This is called, I guess, uh, blaster this is really cool stuff if you need to loosen up like nuts and bolts this stuff's supposed to uh, work really quickly but be real careful with this stuff because it is flammable and uh, it says here excessive inhalation may be fatal blah 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 okay you guys know all about this all right so let's just put this to the side a little loose I don't have the proper tools to remove these uh, this little piece of metal <laughs> so we're going to go in another direction. Sweet! Nice. I can probably put this on a vise later and take it apart. Okay, so what the hell is in here? Oh my goodness, this is heavy. Ah! What is all this stuff? This is iron. I see some pieces of copper, some pieces of brass. There's something in the middle there. I don't know what that is, but we're going to take that apart in a little while. But I know this part I cannot take out. I'm probably going to have to bash it, just like I do with those, uh, with those compressors. Now, this is all copper. That's pretty cool. I don't think there's enough copper in there for me to go crazy and strip it. As you can see, it does look interesting, but not enough for me to rip this all out. I think I'm just going to sell it as a motor. Let's put that to the side. Let's grab this one here. Find out what those little things are inside there. There we go. be like a transistor or something or some sort of uh, device oh okay okay I've seen these before that's all it is 
much of stuff as I thought it was in here, there's not really much stuff in here. Okay. Back to this one. I'm going to leave that alone. I'm not going to do anything with it. I'm going to sell it as a motor. I'm going to put this back in. Put this piece back in. Bolt it back and sell it as a motor. Anyway, that's what was in this. What a waste of time. Sorry to waste your time on this. This is Mike the Scrapper. Till then, peace!